Here, our critical need is to analyze our data in a business intelligence approach. But previously, integrating Pi system data with standard BI tools actually took a fair amount of effort. We recognized a need for a simple, scalable way to make that integration, and that's exactly what the Pi Integrator for BI does. And this is what that can look like, a user-friendly, robust, and repeatable way to interact with Pi system data in TIBCO Spotfire, for example, or via nearly any business intelligence tool. We're incredibly excited about the new insights that this will ultimately offer to Pi system users. And thus to show how realistic and feasible this integration is, we'd like to show you how we used the Pi Integrator for Business Intelligence to end up with this Spotfire analysis as our end result in under three minutes. We began by accessing the integrator online through a modern web interface. I, as the end user, didn't need to install anything on my machine to get started. I first used this data designer to create a new Pi asset view, which would ultimately contain all of the Pi system data, both raw data and calculations, that I wished to analyze in Spotfire. After naming and creating the view, I started adding data by browsing to my desired Pi AF server and Pi AF database. And next, I used this very familiar Pi AF tree view drill down to locate an example of the critical asset, in this case a heat exchanger, whose data I wished to analyze. After selecting that asset, I simply dragged and dropped to include it in my asset shape. And since I wanted to focus on only a subset of that asset's data, I sorted by attribute category to let me drag and drop only the critical temperature attributes that I was interested in, including just those attributes in my final asset shape. I wanted to perform that temperature analysis on all heat exchangers. Fortunately, the integrator made it easy to remove the exact asset name match filter while still including the asset template filter, which allowed the integrator to automatically look up and include all of the same data from all of my other heat exchangers that share the same asset template. It was that simple. Next, I saw a quick preview of my data, which made me realize that I wanted to be able to slice and analyze it by time, by day and hour, for example. So I used the Add Column tool to quickly and easily add the required additional time-related data columns to my final Pi Asset view. I next edited the time frame for this view, setting the start and end time and the sample interval. And I was comfortable with entering in a large time range, as I knew that the modern Pi Integrator for Business Intelligence was designed to accommodate such large data volumes. Finally, I chose to publish all of this as a Pi view, which makes it all accessible via a cutting edge, high throughput ODBC connection. And since almost every flagship business intelligence tool is designed to easily work with ODBC datasets, this meant that I could finally, at the end, effortlessly bring all this data into TIBCO Spotfire, which, as you can see, in this picture-in-picture -picture window, lets me finally analyze my Pi system data in a business intelligence mindset. Regardless of whether it's with Spotfire, Tableau, SAP HANA, or Microsoft PowerView, this will work perfectly with all those and many more. This Business intelligence integration, which was our end goal all along, is now easier and more efficient than ever before, thanks to the Pi Integrator for Business Intelligence.